<laughs> By the way, <laughs> I I try to record Minecraft. And one thing that I really have to say is this game is at the moment way better to record. I get f way, way higher frames per second <coughs> in this game than in, in Minecraft at the moment. It It is, I believe, a problem with the server and I have to see if uh, what I will do about that, but um, it's bad. I'm getting 20 frames per second in uh, in Minecraft, and this game looks way better. And my FPS are 60 because I'm um, because I'm. Oh, and I added uh, landing gears here so that I way so that I can um, anchor the the ship to the platform here okay we need a collector now uh, this thing okay right side up and go for it And it's funny the, the the frames per second go go down when when I'm uh, welding and all that stuff, <laughs> but at the moment they are they are really really good. <coughs> Man, what's going on now? My my throat is doing bad stuff. Okay, more bulletproof glass. Some more construction components. He's still doing construction components. Um, I believe it has. Um, it is about the thing that Minecraft is not using the the graphics card to its advantage. So it's mainly running uh, with the CPU and. I I I don't know the technical the technical stuff behind it but um that seems to be the problem and with the server in the in the background and modded minecraft it it really gets worse <coughs> okay land the ship again I hope I'm not getting sick here that that would be bad okay land the ship anchor the ship and then we can let me see if I can zoom into that. See, you can see the, the the ejector on the back. And I should be able to, um, with K, I can open the terminal of the ship and then I can just um, use the ejector to throw out stuff and collect all. And now it should throw out stuff. No visual effect. <coughs> Why is this not working? Why is this not working? It is on. Collect all. Did I not connected to something here. Ah, uh, I know. <laughs> okay, now, okay, 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 okay. That's that's no problem. <laughs> that's uh, at least I know now that it is not uh, grabbing the stuff from the... Ah, uh, bad thing. That it is not grabbing the stuff from the from the reactors. Okay, we need 
we need a connection from let's see we need these small conveyor belts why is it blinking this we need this why is it blinking i um, i sometimes sometimes i don't understand what this game is doing with me Okay. Uh, sorry, guys. I have to do this this way. I could add another. Oh, now it's not blinking. Hmm. Okay, then it it has to be something with a uh, with a uh, third person view. Okay, we just need to connect the conveyors to this port here and I don't need okay turn it turn it one more and now let's see if we are able to finish it here it's not very expensive but I don't know if I have all the materials at least I don't need bulletproof glass and all that stuff. Just a few construction components and all that stuff. And a motor. But this should work out. And we should... The thing is, we should start to see it drop out stuff uh, as soon as we finish the connection up there. So let's hope. No? No? Yes, good, that works. Now all the materials from the ship are going into our refinery system there automatically. And we don't need to do a thing now, but it will take time. So we could speed that up by using more ejectors. Should we try that maybe? Let's see. Come on, we, we will just we will just do that and see if if that works out. Oh, okay, I even have all the materials. Let me go into the third person view again. And then we can use let's see, oh, oh man. <laughs> I was more prepared than I thought. And then we can look into another mechanic I, that the game provides us with. Okay, go into the ship, we'll get into the terminal, and now we see the ejectors here. I will turn this one off again, and we can use... Uh, we can mark all these ejectors here call them ejector yeah <laughs> and now we have it saved so we can uh click this one and all the ejectors get um marked again and then we can just say ah that's good now it it works better how yeah i i um <laughs> I got some um, some materials in between episodes, so I could show that to you. This is working out fine. This is working out fine. The only thing we always have to do is if when the system is empty, 
and that will take a moment, but when the system is empty, if we want to go on another mining trip, we have to turn it off. So otherwise it will spit out all the materials we gathered uh, into space around us. So, okay, let's see if the refinery gets all the stuff. Ah, yes. Good thing, good thing, good thing, good thing, good thing. And you can see it is providing us with a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff, that's nice. The assembler also has stuff in it. And yeah, it produced all the <laughs> stuff for the we ordered before we started to <laughs> change the ship again. <coughs> good thing, good thing, good thing. Okay, let me take a look. Okay, the gravity is refinery current output one point how many seventy two yeah it is at the moment it is just grabbing all the uranium and putting it into the small reactor still but that's good so we know where it is yeah I finished this connection earlier and um, I think you saw this or don't know but I I connected I will tell you just a, just tell you again I connected the the reactor to the system so it also grabs the the stuff one thing I noticed is that if I have the medical room up there I have to place a block below this here I hope that it also works with conveyors and I will do that later, connect it to the medical room. But when I don't have the block below it, th this is enough. It it doesn't have to be it doesn't have to be finished. Um if it's not there, the medical room is not working, so I can't get energy from it. I forgot to turn on my lights. <coughs> So if you have problems with that anytime, maybe uh, just go and uh, add the block below the medical room where the where the yeah the the access port is. I think that is the access ports are the the kind of connection to the world for the medical room. Okay, I think. This is ready. Fuel time, 158 days. So that's good. We can just... Okay, now we can turn that off again. And we could fly and grab another load of materials here. Uh, okay. That's working out very, very, very nice. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. 